I told our whole leadership team, I want to be able to pass, I call it the bar test, which is I want to be able to sit in a bar and somebody asks where I work. I say, oh, I work for a company called Auto Scheduler. And they say, oh, I've heard of them. Mm. You know, ex- can, can you tell me about this component of the business or can you tell me how you guys are doing? And, and it took us about two years to get there to be able to sit at a bar and say, I work for this company. And so he's like, oh, I work in supply chain. I've heard of Auto Scheduler. I, as the CEO, before we hired a sales team and a few of our, our managing partners did all the sales for the business, all of our budget went to understanding where people get their information from, meaning who do people trust for information and how do we make sure that the people they trust are talking about us. So what we ended up doing is our initial strategy was people trust hearing from what other big companies are doing. We're fortunate that P&G was a first customer of ours, and we could actually leverage some case studies with P&G. But then there's also in supply chain, a few analyst communities where if they say it, everybody listens. And so we spent an exorbitant amount of money on uh, being a part of that research group. So we could actually get feedback from these analysts and during the feedback sessions, be able to brief them on, hey, well, here's what we're seeing with these customers. Here's where we think the market's going. And over the year and a half, two years, instead of us being people that were just getting informed, the analysts actually started to write about things we had talked about. And I never would have thought we were the size, but I actually hired somebody for PR. Mm. Um, and I, I didn't hire an internal PR person. I hired somebody who was an industry specific PR person who knew all of the all of the analysts. She knows all of the people that are writing articles. She understands what their schedule looks like. At this point, I'm probably in an article a week or have written an article a week, me or ghost written article a week. It's probably not a week. It's probably one every two weeks. But I mean, and that's all just to having a really good PR group that understands what we do and getting our name out there and understands that you know, we're kind of at the cutting edge, which finally, you know, so many years of effort have paid off and it's sexy now.